What is up everyone? Thank you for checking out this video. So today I wanted to update you guys on my camera stuff that I'll be taking into 2019. All right, so the first thing is my bag. I'm using a Low Pro. This is their brand new one, I believe. It is the Flipside 300 AW Mark II. This thing has been amazing. I bought it at brand new at Best Buy for I believe 160, 150 around there. So just bought this thing, amazing. Low Pro is always great. Um, let's see. I don't believe I have anything in here. Nothing. Just business cards, like usual. Got a whole stack in there. Like I always say, keep business cards with you. And that's all I keep in there. And, uh, a side note, I want to thank you guys for 300 subscribers. That is awesome. And, uh, like I always say, if you guys have anything to suggest of what kind of videos you want to see, please let me know below and I will make those. Uh, so here's all of my gear, uh, a lot of upgrades, and a lot of new stuff. So actually the first thing is my tripod. Again, I'm using the same tripod as always. It is the Manfrotto 190X with the 496RC2 tripod head, ball head. Works really well, very heavy, so hoping to get carbon fiber one day, but uh, so far this has kept up. So that's my tripod. And I will go with all the good stuff. So I keep a lot of extra batteries. I have four, so one's in the camera right now, all marked. Uh, a lot of them are uh, third party. I have one Canon one, and they still work pretty well. Uh, right here are my ND filters. And I got 82 and 77 millimeter. And I got brand new ones. I wanna see if they say the name on there. See, they are NJY Touch. They are from eBay and they're actually relatively inexpensive and they work insanely well, especially with wide angle lenses. So that's all that I have is NG, NJY Touch and ND864 and obviously a 10 stop right there. All right, so those are my ND filters. Highly recommended. Again, all links will or all descriptions of what I have will be below. And another thing I want to emphasize is that I do buy all my gear. I know a lot of people dislike these videos because they say they're rich or their parents buy them, but uh, yeah, I buy all my gear from photography and I do work also, and I'm also a college student. So I just have a Gerber Leatherman tool right here and just useful for anything, especially if my tripod gets a little loose during the shoot or something, so that's great. And I actually just picked this up also. This is a L bracket. So this thing works with the Manfrotto tripod. And I got this on eBay for I believe like $60. Uh, I know Manfrotto's is like almost 200 bucks. So this thing's amazing and it's nice quality. Uh, just a cloth, some spray, and a little cheap timer. And that works really well for star trails, just to keep that shutter open. And some wrenches, covers, and my extra backup plate, just in case I forget my L bracket. So just a little boring stuff, and that's all that's in that compartment right there. And I keep all my SD cards up here. And I recently upgraded all my SD cards to uh, SanDisk, but they are the Extreme Pros. I used to just have the beginner, I guess, but uh, I needed faster reading speed, so that is what I use now. Compact flash cards right here, and just a few other smaller cards, but uh, Extreme Pro, those are very nice. So that's all I have with SD cards. And now to the great stuff. But first, my strap right here. This strap is leather. It is by ProMaster. And this thing's great. Looks really nice when you're going on shoots, especially uh, weddings. And it's held up. And all it is is just connected by buckles on each side and connects to your camera straps on the camera. So let's begin with the lenses first. Obviously, I had the 16-35 f4 Canon lens. This thing is amazing. It also has IS. Okay, so if you want wide angles, I highly recommend this lens right here. This thing is, uh, has been and is my favorite lens 
that I've always had. All right, so that's a 1635. And now new to the bag is the Canon 70 to 200 f2.8 non-IS. Um, I'm still debating if that was a good choice if I not getting IS, but uh, so far it's been really great. Heavy, but I mean, you just can't beat the f2.8 f2 on this thing. Refurbished by Canon, so, and it has a one year warranty, so it's definitely worth it. But this thing is incredible if you need those long extra shots at weddings or for portraits, and that's what I use this one for. So that is new. And then, of course, my body, which I actually upgraded to the 5D Mark III. I've been talking about upgrading for a while now, ever since making these videos. So the time has finally come, and I have upgraded to the 5D Mark III. And I couldn't be happier from going from the 6D to the 5D Mark III. This thing is incredible, and I'm super happy with it. So that was definitely a great purchase. And of course, I still have the 2470 f2.8 by Canon. Again, this thing is incredible for an all-around lens. You cannot go wrong with this lens. This thing is incredible with the constant f2.8, and it's sharp, colors are great, and highly recommend it. So, that that's, that's it for my bag. It's super simple, but it gets the job done. Um, if you guys have any questions about any of this gear, uh, anything about photography related, really anything you want, just please comment below and I will answer back to them. So please follow me on Instagram, at Nick Heller. Check out my website, nickheller.com, hellerphotography.com. All links below. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Questions, please leave them below. And thank you guys so much for watching.